so cool. To integrate both of them, you know. I've heard a lot of people do it, but I can't get a man, but I don't believe the guys are going to be crazy if they're throwing on it because just certified organic people. See the peppers? I use neem oil, which is a natural thing. Uh, now, in the late, late summer, when the, if the spider mites come, I will use a mite brush. Uh, spider mites love hot. There's eggplant. This is yellow squash. Yellow squash. Jojo, do you see the pig? Are you looking at the pig? Where's the chickens? Where's the chickens? There's pigs and chickens. It's a huge pig. It was talking to us earlier, but now it's sleeping. Pretty cool. What's the pig and chickens doing? Are they sleeping? Say shh. Say shh. I did once. Everybody's doing was making tail kill. Oh, yeah. I've never made them myself. I've had from the store, but I want to make them. They do them in the oven, don't they? I think so. Jojo, say hi, Piggy. The pig and the chickens are best buddies. That's a huge pig, huh? Say bye, pig. Say bye, pig. Say bye, piggy. Say bye, farm. Bye, farm. Cute little house. Jojo's hanging on the farm. We can come out on sit Sunday drives and see the pumpkin patch. See you know a pumpkin patch. There's a pumpkin. We got a greenhouse going to rebuild. This is neat, man. Did you have fun at the farm? We support the local farmers. Well, here's what this does. Here's what this does right here. This takes you out of reality, out of the city, out of the hustle and bustle, brings you out here, enjoy the country air, support a local farmer, eat good, fresh produce, and it's just something different. Now, we did pay a, a program fee to be a part of it, but, you know, I so, think it's a good, so well this, worth spit. This farmer is part of what you call a CSA, a Community Supported Agriculture, or something like that. Maybe. Right. <laughs> Gave us some free eggs. And uh, you pay like $200 per season and each week you get a box of vegetables whenever he's got growing and you go pick, us. there's like four different pickup spots you can go that he takes on Tuesday and he showed us we're all through all his farm. We went there and toured through everything, showed us everything he had. That was a really cool experience, man. That was awesome. <laughs> I really think that was really neat. So we've never done anything like this. It's kind. I'm kind of nervous because it, it's kind of a gamble. You're taking a risk because you don't know if something happens with the weather. But here's the thing too. You go to a grocery crops store. could be destroyed. But here's what's really cool about what we just did. You go to a grocery store. You have no idea where your fruit, your vegetables are coming in from all over the world. We just went and met the farmer that's going to grow our fruit and vegetables for us. And I just shook his hand. The actual guy that's planting the seeds with his finger. That's pretty awesome, dude. And it's a big farm for one guy to be handling by himself. And we get the chance to get out as a family, go for a little drive, let JoJo cry a little bit. This guy's going to pass me. I'm going 665. Go ahead, buddy. We're going fast enough for you. Sorry. So that was a fun experience, and we're excited about it. But yeah. And we actually gave him a little bit extra because we, we really like supporting what he does. So Jared gave him extra money, and he probably was like, what the heck? Nobody does this. Exactly. Um, if I was kind of debt free and living like no one else right now, I would have given him a lot more. So it's, it's going to be kind of, it's going to be a lot different because, you know, I plan my meals and I go buy what I need. And this time I'm going to have to base what I cook around what I'm able to get from them. But I'll be glad knowing that it's, we're eating good stuff and that there wasn't a lot of fuel spent in transporting it. That's bad for the environment. We didn't does eggs and he had a huge pig and Jojo oh, yeah. got excited when she saw the pig. And chickens. But she doesn't know what that pig was for. Oh, he said that he's been raising it for two years and he's gonna slaughter it soon. He's getting really attached to it. He said he's not gonna be able to be the one to put him down. I thought that was sad. We're falling in love with this pig. Anyway, so that was neat. Man. I was really nervous about going there because and it was weird when we pulled up because yeah. we didn't know what to it's do. Just him. We didn't see anybody there but it turned out good. So. Nice guy too, man. What the place is called? L Cajun Farms. L C H A N. 
the Cajun because he's from Louisiana. Yeah, it was neat. Really cool experience. Okay, we just got back from our first CSA pickup. Uh, it was not on the actual farm that where it's grown. He delivers it to a location closer to us in our area. And since it's the first week, there's not much, but it should get more... We should get more and get more of a variety as the weeks go on, but these are some eggplants. This one looks good. And some cucumbers, which I love. Here's a different eggplant. I need to look up what kind that is. And some tomatoes. A bunch of peppers. Red and green. And some radishes. So, I've never really cooked or done anything with radishes or eggplants, like maybe eggplants once. So I'm going to have to figure out what to do. If anybody has any suggestions, please leave a comment on good recipes for this stuff. Um, I went ahead and meal planned the other day because I got to go shopping this weekend. And I didn't add any sides, so I'm just going to have to figure out ways to incorporate these. And while we were there at the little at the farm, they have a little store where they have other things for sale. We got us some chicken because I already had chicken on the menu. And then this bread, it's a local bread from Dallas, and it's definitely more expensive than regular bread at the store, four dollars. So hopefully it's good. And Jared just had to have these tamales because he loves tamales, and we don't eat them much. So that's my first CSA haul. Pretty cool.